The Colorado Department of Early Childhood proposing a new enrollment process for universal preschool. As we've reported, parents, frankly, they're frustrated with this current enrollment process. Many of them told us their children were matched with the school only to find out there was not enough space. News 5's Eleanor Sheehan spoke with one Colorado Springs preschool today and shares how the state hopes to fix these issues. The Colorado Universal Preschool, or UPK, program was implemented at the beginning of the school year. Families used an online application process to match their child with the school of their choice, but it caused some frustrations. It was so difficult. There's no communication. We don't know what's happening. The only emails I ever got from UPK was, Congratulations on first round matches, second round matches. We're after that, we're told nothing. I'm hoping that this is working out for families as as they want it to. Unfortunately for our family, that is not the case. Liz Denson is the president of Early Connections Learning Center in Colorado Springs. She says the current process has caused some confusion. The process was kind of convoluted for families. There was um, families had to go in and apply. Um, they had to be matched to us, and then they had to go and accept the match. And then we as the provider had to also accept the match. The newly proposed enrollment process would show families which schools have open spots in real time to avoid confusion. It would also allow parents to pre-register their child in the school of their choice. Allowing families who are currently enrolled or who have siblings who are currently enrolled or children of staff members to be able to have that pre-registration opportunity earlier in the year. Denson says pre-registration would help them plan ahead. We'll then know and we can kind of get out of the way the children who we know we have to care for. Um, and then it allows us to operate the, the opportunity to identify what additional slots we may be able to open in various classrooms. Denson believes in order to help families, the application needs to provide more information about each specific school. We, the providers, have to go in and basically build our profiles all over again. But the new system will have greater opportunity for us to be able to describe the exact programs that we offer um, and giving families that greater understanding from the beginning of their enrollment process. Denson says families had to go through many challenges to get UPK this school year, but she's confident that a new application will help. Being able to understand where they were in the process, what's the next step, how do I actually ensure that I am enrolled. If approved, the new enrollment process would take effect before the start of the 2024-2025 school year. Reporting in Colorado Springs, Eleanor Sheehan, News 5.